welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited because I'm going to be doing kind of a chill unboxing, sort of. Um, I have three Nendroids that I'm going to be unboxing from the same series and usually on my Nendroid unboxing videos I kind of show myself opening it up and then putting the character in different poses and all that stuff but I think since I have three that I'm gonna unbox I'm just gonna do like quick unboxing of it I'm not gonna show the process of me actually unboxing it I will show you the different poses uh, I just won't film me actually taking it out of the box and everything and then I will um, tell you my thoughts and the reason why I'm not gonna go into too much detail of this unboxing is because these Nendroids have been out for a while and I'm sure everybody <laughs> has them at this point I was a little late uh, to getting these guys but I am so happy that I do. And it is the, you're like, okay, what is it? It is the <laughs> Haikyuu Nendroids. So I have Suga, I have Oikoa, and then I have Kuro. I do have, y'all, <laughs> I freaked out yesterday. Yesterday, they re-released Oikoa's school, I think, school uniform version of this nendroid and we all know how expensive those are and how because they're so rare they're rare so i'm so happy they brought it out i do have kenma pre-ordered and then i have i had them pre-ordered a while ago and then i have bokuto uh pre-ordered which i freaking love bokuto and then I, I'm planning on getting, I know I need the main two, I need like Tobio and Hinata, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I haven't gotten them yet. I think these guys, well Oikoa is my favorite Haikyuu character, so that's why I got him. And then before, when I first got into Haikyuu, before Oikoa showed up, I <laughs> had Suga as my favorite and I still love him so much. I still think he's so precious. And then Kuro is another favorite of mine. I'm, I'm picking my favorites, as you can see, first. And then I have Bokuto coming and Kenma, so I'm so excited. I've been rambling on. Please make sure you like this video if you like it. And leave a comment. And tell me what you think. And, you know, you know the drill. Please subscribe. And yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off with my favorite boy, Oikawa. Okay, this is so exciting. I forgot that these Nendroids actually have like the little gym tiles or floors. Ah, okay, we have his cute little face plates. Okay, I'm gonna, I said I want to do like a detailed thing about it. Yo, I love Oikoa so much. I will say he is so much cuter in person. Oh my god. Tell me he's not cute. I freaking love Oiko so much. So many people say he's annoying and they don't like him and I'm just like, how can you not love him? Sorry if you guys can hear the rain. It's like a storm outside, but oh my god. Okay y'all, he even comes with his little jersey where he's not even wearing the sleeves. It kind of looks like a cape. He's so cute. Um, he comes with his volleyball, he comes with two face plates. I <laughs> love this face plate so much. Um, another face plate I'm so excited for uh, is in his school uniform one where he's sticking his tongue out at Tobio. Literally my favorite like thing he does of all time it's so funny i i he's such a troublemaker i love him so much favorite like i said favorite haiku character uh every time i look at his the little bandages i forgot his kneecaps kneecaps his knee 
knee pads. Every time I look at his knee pads, I always think of that headcanon that he broke his uh, knee or dislocated his knee or whatever. And I actually thought that was real for like a good ass minute, you guys. So apparently it's not, but that's what I heard. So if it is real, can y'all tell me? Because I keep going back and forth on whether that's real or not. I haven't read the manga, so my first thought was, oh, this was probably confirmed in the manga or maybe the author confirmed it or something and I just don't know anything about it. So can y'all let me know, is that actually a real thing or is that just a headcanon? Because I keep going back and forth with that. I think it's a headcanon, but that's a pretty good head <laughs> I kind of like it because I'm into a lot of angst angsty stuff so yeah anyways yeah I like making myself sad apparently moving on to the next character oh, I just can't stop staring at him he's so cute next we are going to go ahead and unbox the mommy of the group Suga so like I said before Suga was my first favorite character it was Suga and then uh, Yamaguchi was a very close second and yeah <laughs> then Oikawa showed up and I'm it was love at first sight y'all know that TikTok trend that everybody's doing on anime TikTok where it's like two characters meet and instantly fall in love with each other and this background song is like hello hello y'all know what I mean that was when that was me when I saw Oikoa for the first time on screen. <laughs> We're done with Oikoa. We are moving on to Suga. Oh, he's so cute. Honestly, you guys, they nailed the high figures. I feel like the high figures are some of Good Smile's best Nendroids out there. Oh my god. Like everything about it, the hair sculpt, everything. Everything adorable so that's his like default face and then he has he comes with two other faces as well i think they all they all come with volleyballs but he has this grinning face and then he has this cute smiling face i don't know what i'm gonna keep him as <laughs> which pose i'm gonna keep him in but here are the different poses that he comes in and he's so cute oh my god So that was Stuka, absolutely adorable. Y'all, it's so humid, oh my god. Okay, next up we are gonna go ahead and unbox Kudo. Really wanted to unbox him when Kenma came out, but Kenma comes out in like July or something. I'm not waiting that long. All right, all right, all right. We have, oh my god. <laughs> Why didn't I get these sooner? They're so cute. <laughs> I think I didn't get them when they released because I was like, I don't want Nendroids, I just want scale figures. I think I mentioned that too in a video I did a while back that like, oh, I don't want to collect Nendroids that much. I'll make only a few exceptions. And then <laughs> now I have like so many Nendroids. So here is Kudo, I think his head might be really heavy. His head is looser than the other one, so hopefully that's not gonna be a, do you see that he just went? Okay, hopefully that's not gonna be a problem when I actually sit him on the shelf. But, <laughs> he's so freaking cute, y'all. And then just like Oikoa, he comes with a jersey, uh, his Nekoma jersey, where he doesn't put the sleeves on. Oika it was, was pretty hard to put on, but let me see if Kudos is, hold on. They're both really hard to put on, I don't know why. I don't wanna force it through right now, but I will show it to you in the B-roll. And then he comes with two face plates. We have this <laughs> scary, but still adorable looking face plate. 
and then we have a smiling face plate which people I think display use this one when he's displayed next to Kenma um, and then oh my god what I really love about this is the little calico cat and then I think Kenma comes with a black cat so I think this one's supposed to represent Kenma and then the black cat that Kenma comes with represents Kudo and I really love that and yeah that just made me want to have both of them here are the poses I will show you in the b-roll take a good look they're they are all adorable Honestly, like I said, I wish I had ordered them sooner. I wish I wasn't so stubborn in the in saying, oh, I'm only gonna collect scale figures because y'all look at these. These are so good. Um, and yeah, so I do have to get the rest of them. I do still need to get Tobio and Hinata, but I feel like everybody else is so expensive. And Hinata and Tobio, even if their price does go up, it won't go up as much as these guys have. I know Asahi is either a way too hard to find or he's like three hundred dollars y'all like why and then i can't find um oh god y'all this happens to me every time i record i think it's because i'm nervous when i record and i forget everything but i think oh daichi i can't find daichi and then when you do he's also very expensive so is um tsuki i think not as much as the other ones I mentioned, and then uh, Yamaguchi. I don't know why. Maybe it's because they haven't gotten re-released as much as these guys. I don't. I really don't know what the reason is. But anyways, those were the three Nendroids. I think they're super cute. I love them so much. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video, which is hopefully hopefully soon. Bye bye guys.